Four people have been killed and at least 16 injured in Tel Aviv after two Palestinian gunmen opened fire on a popular market complex. The attack mars the beginning of the holy month of Ramadan, now in its third day. Hwang Ojun reports. Two gunmen killed at least four people and injured several others when they opened fire on a popular open-air market complex in Tel Aviv on Wednesday night local time. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has condemned the attack as a savage crime of murder and terrorism. We're going to take the necessary steps to uh, attack the attackers and to defend those who need to be defended. Officials say the shooters, both 21 years old, are from the same family in a Palestinian village in the West Bank and entered Israel illegally. They had disguised themselves by dressing as ultra-Orthodox Jews and posed as customers at a restaurant. The attackers were disarmed by security forces. One was arrested and the other was shot and has been hospitalized. Hamas, a Palestinian Sunni Islamic fundamentalist organization, claimed responsibility for the attack. It shared a cartoon of a traditional Palestinian Ramadan treat being stuffed with a bullet with the caption, Tel Aviv Operation. Hailing the shootings as a, quote, heroic operation, Hamas also promised, quote, the Zionists more surprises during the Muslim holy month of Ramadan. In response, UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon denounced the shooting in an official statement and criticized Hamas leaders for glorifying those who commit such heinous acts. Washington also expressed condemnation in a statement and said that cowardly attacks against innocent civilians can never be justified. Hong Woo-jun, Arirang News.